Um, okay. We are live and good to go. And yeah, we'll be jumping almost straight into it in a few minutes. And today what we're doing is we are playing War of the Seven Realms. It's the challenge map that I started uh, not very long ago. It's, uh, yeah, it's a very nice paced uh, challenge map here on Shadow of Death. And that is going to be exactly what we're doing. Hey, Mars. Yo, yo. Mm -hmm. Hey, Benji. Did I play yeah, the Empire here on this uh, client, I guess? Hey, Elias. Agent Satan. Yo, yo. Oh, uh, what map? Uh, the map is gonna be War of the Seven Realms. Um, it is in the title. Hey, Eustace. What's up, baby shot? What's up? Um, uh, not much right now. Hey, Shadow Wolf. So, we're gonna be getting right to it. Uh-huh. King Leopold has lost his torso. Someone stole it during the night. Oh, yeah, this one. I remember. Uh, anyway, we are going to be doing this one over here, and, um, hmm, wait, which is the save that I, that is, like, the latest one? I was going over here, uh, but this is not it. Was it this one? No, I already went past this. Why is that astral? Yeah, this is astral here. Yeah, this is way too early. Um, Black Shore Taken, Lake, Queen Defense, Meeting, Demon Done. Wait, which is my latest save? Wait, did I not make a save? I mean, even if I didn't, that would be like very, very little that I'm missing out on. Oh, uh, yeah. <clears throat> All right. I play Heal 3 from 2000. Um, hey, Sylvia. Welcome, welcome. Nice to have you. And yeah, I think this is going to be like the latest save. We're going to be having to go here again for a tiny little bit. And uh, yeah, if I remember correctly, we found the guy that Astral was uh, telling us to go to. And that was the latest update. Uh, we have some quests here to do. Uh, wait, I have like a very annoying fly here. Um, so if I have like some weird movement, then it is me trying to battle against it. Uh, so yeah. We still have Angelina collecting angels. We still have our Queen Sarna doing stuff as well. Um, yeah. And we're doing really well all around. We recently have uh, vanquished the demons from our lands. And now we have the entire of our buy-in actually to ourselves, which is very nice. Uh, we have Leon Soul Trapped over here. that We're probably going to be freeing uh, with these tests over here. So yes, we are here to get tested. Uh, apparently. I can't remember, did you ever play the Fallout games? Not really. I think I tried New Vegas for like a tiny little bit at some point, but uh, not really much of it at all. I wonder if I could choose that dude somehow. That'd be pretty cool. Beat the Elementals, beat Master Water. So Master Water is going to be like the biggest, baddest boss, eh? Okay. Um. Anyway, for now we can... Mission hold, this is the domain of the Great Wizards in Timo. Well, yeah, that's, that is the point, yes. Mm, are we gonna be fine here? Uh, we definitely need to preserve all the peasants, because they I need exactly that many for the quest. So, yeah. I do have Resurrection, which is uh, pretty nice. Rip Peasantos. Um, I mean, I will be able to just please wreck them in a little bit, so that's why I'm continuing to fight. So maybe we can get a better cast here. Like, the air shield is very frustrating to deal with. Bloodlust, not so much. Because, uh, past Bloodlust, we can actually one shot anyway. So, that's pretty cool. I did not mean to do that. 
That's pretty bad, actually. Do I have teleport? No, I don't. Mm. Yeah, let's do that again. Um, oops. There's a family game, huge month, coming out in a month, and I am high. Follow for London. That does sure sound like something. Not something that I'm particularly um, interested about, to be honest, but uh, yeah. Sounds like uh, something cool coming out for the Fallout guys. I need to attack here and here. And I need to be resurrecting at the same time. I did lose the ammo card, but I think that's fine. Yeah, okay. Um, just the ammo card will do. Uh, we can use our uh, boost of rotation, so yeah. I guess I'll reread this. As you enter the strange line, you see a big tower ahead of you. The door to it to open, and an old man walks towards you. He looks very similar to Astral. Zentimo. Hello, I am Zentimo. One of the great, one of the three great wizards. We have work to do. I heard you have already met Astral. Well, he died trying to send you here, so you better not disappoint me. I will teach you uh, great spells, but I need to test you first. Go and beat the three elemental masters to prove that you are as good as they say you are. Um. Okay, so yeah, that's exactly what we're going to be doing. And this is where we left off. Uh, we could be walking around through some more of this army. Did I complete all the quests that I hear that I'm into? No, I did not. Um, as this guy wanted the helm. Oh yeah, the disrupting ray. Well, I'm really care, friend. This guy also wants peasants. Oh, also I should garrison some of the army that I don't need actively. Um, so that way the, everything is going to be like just way more convenient and nice. The angels here seem to have already been picked up. And is there anything that I can actually develop into? Um, kind of. I mean, Mr. Pond seems decent to do. And I'm just gonna go over all the towns real quickly again. To see if I'm not really missing out on any value. Like, for example, the resource silos kind of value. Um, I'll do that. And, uh, Thought to the Fortune, yeah, sure. Wait, that was the, like, defense. Well, whatever. Um, it's not like we are, you know, like, scrambling for resources here or anything. Hmm, he did go like that. Yo, it's BB again. Uh, yeah. No PvP today. Uh, no. Uh, so yeah, it's in Timo. Am I gonna be having to beat him? Yeah, we'll have to beat him. Or, what is happening here? Cornucopia. Cornucopia. Okay. Um, anyway, I'm putting these in here, and I'm just gonna be walking around with these stacks. Oh, uh, we can get the garden. Master water. Alright. Master earth. Okay. Uh huh. I would be able to go here after Master Water. I'm not sure if I'm strong enough yet, but I guess we'll just try, right? I don't particularly... S oh, that's a big upgrade in terms of my necklace and in terms of my sword. And yeah, the rest I'll equip as we go. Finally interesting content. Lee Peasants and Garrison. Yeah. So we have Leon over here, and we are going to be equipping any sort of power that we can get our hands on. Are we like close to Arc Element? No, not even close. That is good. Nothing here that would be any useful to me in the actual battle. Um, yeah, except for this. And yeah, let's just... Let's just try it and see how it feels, you know? Hmm. Of course, I kind of forgetfulness these guys. Oh, uh, I guess might is not that amazing. We do one shot a stack here. 
However, um, he ends up summoning more. Which is rather frustrating. Can I outlive the mana here? I believe I can, which is very cool. I think I want to bless. Then using the wave turn, I can slow them down. Like, these shots don't really matter, the ones that are coming out right now. Um, he still has like four stacks to summon, that is like nothing. So, yeah, we're gonna just be fine. Every single new stack gets um, shot here and uh, we are completely fine. I know, now we fully kill. He still has two stacks remaining. Okay, and this is like all of them, so I can just wrap it up. Okay, so Master Water was not really much of a master, and now I can summon some water elementals myself. Is there maybe anything hidden here? Uh, we should be probably looking out for any secrets here that we might be having. Um, yeah. I would assume this was actually one of the harder uh, of the fights that I'm going to be doing, to be honest. I mean, is this guy very strong? He doesn't look like it, but I guess we'll see, right? Not really much to be collected over here, unless I won some stats on the queen. I mean, maybe. Why not? I would like her to go on a boat, but I do not have any boats remaining. Hope you have a great stream and see ya. Yeah, see you over on Elias. Okay, Angelina over here can now go over a new lap, and, uh... Yeah, we are gonna be fighting Master Earth. He summons... well, I guess a few of them. Now I can summon my own elemental steel. Though they don't really do too much. So it doesn't really matter, and they are so slow, it's a little bit pathetic. Yeah, so in order to master the effort, just have to beat down a lot of shedders. Oh, that was an annoying uh, respawn point, but uh... Yeah, it's all good. That's not what I meant to cast, actually, but... Is within the realms of acceptable. Oh, these elementals are actually kind of strong, though. Um, yeah. Didn't even get the uh, past mana. And now we can summon earth elementals of our own. And now, I guess there's gonna be Master... Yeah, there's probably gonna be Master Fire on the right side here. Uh, we can recover our mana and go again. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be a new army for Queen Sarna to be picking up here. I mean, I don't really see a reason for her not to be making these laughs around all of this army. As, you know, every single elf that I get here ends up being a sharpshooter, and that is beautiful. And I want it to be that way. This guy is just running around, we can, oh uh, yeah, grab the angel, grab some more sharpies, and, uh, I mean, yes, eventually those will be sharpies, I think. I mean, I hope. <laughs> Not much happening over there. Um, the queen can still be rallying everything. I wonder if I'm getting TP over there or not. And yeah, this is basically all the dwellings that I was needing, and we can also get the windmill. So, Queen can actually rally up all the army in two turns. That's uh, pretty convenient. Very nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, easily predictable Master Fire. Yeah, he still loses, but uh, we are better than that. 
Summons 200. Actually, this might be one of the harder ones, but uh, nothing that will give us that many issues. It would be very nice if I could one shot with Sharpies, but I can't. I can't. <clears throat> I do not have anything that would boost my the damage of the uh, Sharpies anymore. I think I will have to brawl here some. Okay, that gives me quite a bit of initiative here. Oh. Uh... So, yeah, I just shoot every single new stack, and we should be okay. Uh huh. Um, sometimes lucky. Um, yeah, anyway. All very easy. There's gonna be no more elementals coming out, and we can clean it up. Oh, uh, yeah. There we go. Um, and now we can summon Fire Elementals as well, if we ever need to. We probably don't. Hey, Pixon! Uh, the other heroes have, like, still some work to do. Well, some of them at least. Hmm. Uh, can recover some mana, and we can go over here. I do not have the Brown Border Gate. I can actually go over there, too. Oh, very good, very good. I will get you blind now. You are probably wondering why Hell came back, huh? Well, a long time ago, way before your woodland realm even existed, there was a great battle between Hell and Heaven. Astral, me, and Zargon were fighting on the side of Heaven, and we managed to win, but we needed to seal the portal to Hell to prevent the demons from coming back, so Zargon sacrificed himself to seal the portal. It just remained shut, for, uh, but about 50 years ago, I learned about the necromancer far to the north, who was, uh... Reanimating the dead to fight on his side. He managed to reanimate Zargon and open the portal once more. Hell came back and now the Necromancer, also known as Death, wishes to turn all the realm into his graveyard. So if you wish not to see Woodland in ruins, you have to help me stop him. I open the portal to the northern wastelands, go there, and then through the passage in the mountains, find Death and kill him. That should kill all the, of the dead, including Zargon. If he can return with his body, I might have something in mind that can seal the portal to hell once again. Okay, now I know blind. That's a pretty good spell, yes. Make a choice. Orb of Driving Rain. Wow. Sentinel. Okay. Zero? Anyway. Mmm... The Angelina can still be collecting all of these, and that's all pretty good. Nothing for Queen to collect, and uh, yeah, sure. What is the goal of the map, by the way? Defeat the hero, Mr. Satan. You may also defeat all heroes and towns. Okay. Um, got it. Okay, we did beat the elements, and we can double up the mana. Uh, are we taking our... wait, maybe we should take, um... These, but... yeah, I think we should probably take these guys. So I'll just, like, load back a turn. Um, so I don't have to go, like, as far back, you know? Um, that'll make it a little bit more convenient. Save a little bit of time, get, a, like, a little bit more high score. So I can be a beautiful Archangel at the end of the game. As I deserve to be. Why are these guys fighting me? Why am I fighting them? Why aren't they like Loki my allies? Also, I just got the um dark blue tent. Does that matter? Does that enable any for me to do something new? Yeah, like go here, for example. 
I don't know what is here, but... Well, I mean, it's probably something, right? Oh, uh, from Chaos Hydras... That's pretty easy, and boost all of the too. Maybe I should have gone here early. Uh, we also have Sneaker, who actually looks kind of easy, and he's also kind of stuck there. Pretty funny. Mm -hmm. <coughs> defeat Zagan. Wait, we're supposed to defeat Zagan? This is Zagan. Uh, what about Dev? Who's Dev? What am I fighting them? And why? Hmm. Where's this portal that he conjured up? That he talked about? I guess we might be getting to it soon. And, uh... Yeah, that's all there is to it. Defeat Zerfix. Who's Zerfix, by the way? This one. No, that's Zerfax. Is there Zerfax? Oh no, this is this. This is Zerfax. <laughs> okay. Um, I guess we can talk to you next week over here, so we can chill on that hero by now. And we have two portals, all right in front of us. Wastelands to the north, swamps near the West Promore. I also want to check out this. Brown. Okay, I cannot do that yet. Uh, then we shall be saving here. Uh, I think it was number five, and uh, we're gonna be doing one way. Hey, Baliam, and Hmm, I want to gamble. Well, uh, there's nothing exactly to gamble on right now. So, yeah, Wastelands. This is where I'm supposed to go, Leon. The north and wastelands, hmm, once upon a time there was a great double kingdom, endless forbs here, now it's a barren wasteland. Northern wasteland, thank you. Uh, is this the... probably not. Hmm, why exactly are we here? Don't remember. Uh, yeah. Anyway, uh, we're gonna be moving... Ooh. Marksmen and angels available to uh, recruit and blessing. It's nice. And yeah, that happens every week, if I remember correctly. That's a lot of elementals. Wow. Wait, that's a lot of elementals. And also, what is this? That's a lot of... Uh... Yeah, that's just a lot. Do we have enough damage? I probably should use. This is also Curves Round, so there's no like high tier spell cast. No, I want to redo this a little bit. I want to have it be a little bit more convenient, and we and we can make that happen pretty easily by just making a single Archangel stack. And now build downs. They're kind of built out already, to be honest. Like there's some upgrades missing, but upgrades are not a big deal here, not at all. So we're dealing with the whites first. And I will be able to garrison some of my armor here too, maybe. I mean, I will be able to. I'm saying it's maybe reasonable. 540, 580. It's not been that big of a difference in terms of um, how many turns that stack takes to kill, whether it's white or zombies. Oh, we can kill. 
Oh, look at the peasants here doing work. Wow. Anyway, I need to start hiding them more than I currently am. Oh, um, that's pretty good. Wait, this is really, really bad. Because I cannot resurrect those, so those far sharpies are gone to the nether run forever. You know what? I'll just accept that and move on. Five sharpies. I believe we have, like, way more army than we need. So, uh, yeah, I'll just tank that cost. I still have enough uh, shots on my sharpies here to do the fight, so yeah. This was basically just a test of patience. Uh, we also level up a few times, and we can put away the units that I don't need here. And, uh, what was this for? This was for summoning a boat or something, but I don't even have a boat to summon. Um, interesting, I guess. Yeah. I guess we can do the treasury. Do the Charlodites, and so on. That's a legion of skellies. I didn't see them before. <laughs> they are camouflaged. Um, yeah. Leon is leveling up real good. By the way, Leon's soul sucks. Did I ever mention that? Like, his soul is just not very good at the video game. What can I say? We have quite a bit of gold, and we are getting even more gold with the treasury too, which is pretty cool. Uh, we're going to be making another route for the army here. I should be, I think, still recruiting for the externals, as it makes quite the difference. It's actually a pretty big percentile of the army that we're gaining, so... And it's not like a very hard route either. Easy to remember, just a single route, pick up everything along the way, and we are fine. Uh, yeah. We have stables, we have riches, we have... Conquest? Hmm. Anyway, I am picking everything up here, right? Hourglass of the Evil Hour is kind of whatever. Um, yeah. These fights are quite a bit easier than the gate. Uh, kind of makes me think that I wasn't really supposed to do the gate yet, but... That doesn't exactly matter either. I don't really care for all these resources, I mean... It's not like I'm short on anything, ever. But maybe I will be. Maybe these are big piles, you know? No, they're not big piles at all. Uh, and I can't even access the warrior's team, either. Do we know anything about the Grail? It seems... okay. Conquest wants in on the action. Yeah, none of the piles here are big. Is there like any secret passage here? Is there really not much of a point except for collecting like a little bit of resources? Um, interesting. Seems like there's not. So, that was kind of like a waste of time. Um, I guess it's not too bad. I wonder if there's plague in here, and if there is, maybe I should actually be doing something about it. Hmm, really, it doesn't really feel like there's plague. Oh, there's um, undead town over here, huh? As we got Cover of Darkness. Not hanging that one dwelling. Um, there's a um, green dragon dwelling that is uh, blocked by a quest that I can't exactly unlock right now. 
Um, and the Pegasus uh, is just like a decoration, like this one. Like, I cannot access this in any way. So, those are the two dwellings that are not flagged, and those are the reasons. Nothing to be sorry about. Uh, yeah, more mines. I mean, I'm not sure if I ever will get to a point that I'm lacking gold or resources, but... I guess we may have, may as well have like a little bit of insurance here. Um, so yeah, we are conquering the wasteland. Um, getting Leon stronger here is of course going to be like a relevant good thing to do. We have more than max mana, so the magic ball is going to be useless to me. This seems to be the passage that Sentamon told me about. You walk into grey land full of skeletons and corpses, as if someone has dug the graves of the dead. Ahead of you, you see an army out of skeletons, an unbelievable sight. Leon, what have I got myself into, you wonder? You cannot defeat death. Okay, well. Water wheel? This is a water wheel. Okay, um, anyway. Oh, we have Conquest over here. So, what is this guy all about? This guy has skeletons. Do you cast anything? Oh, yes you do. Oh, yes you do. Um... Well, I do not believe this is gonna be the way to do this. Um, uh, but we can do quite a bit better. Um, uh, we can... Yeah, we can figure something out here. Hmm? I guess I probably want these one stacks, and we can... Oh wait, I should have blessed here already. Wait, what? He doesn't cast anymore? Okay, now he casts, interesting. Oh yeah, I can't resurrect this guy. Mm. Whatever. Nice, it doesn't cast anything. That gives me like just some extra time to do my own thing. And I shall send in another guy. Just to die. I don't mind losing like a few sharpies for the sake of this fight. Oh uh, yeah. So I have just beat death. I mean conquest, not death yet. Oh uh, yeah. The valley is full of these skeletons. A black curse sets upon you. Uh rip my crystals, I guess. Stuff. Um sure. I mean, it doesn't really bother me. I mean, I'm, I'm kind of loaded, you know? There go our resources. Yeah, there they go. Can I build this? I could, like, try and spend on... Eh, war. This guy looks a little bit pathetic to you. Wait, why did I just do that? I don't care for this. Oh, a powerful spell indeed. We just got force field, yo. This is a cursed ground. Like a, is there like a hex of not cursed ground so I could fight using the new spell that I just got? Hmm. Okay, well, our resources are being set ablaze. Maybe we should have... wait, maybe I'll redo a turn, actually. It's a little bit cheesy, but... Uh... Hey. I'll just, like... Yeah... Transfer them to something that I can keep. It's... I don't think it's necessary. Oh, I'm losing wood and ore to you. Hmm. Okay, now we don't have to worry about these events at all. 
Uh, and we're gonna be free to move around here. Um, however we please. Mm, that's pretty good. So this guy is Walking Dead and Wraith Guy. Hmm, that's quite a few of them. Stone skin is like nothing. 18 shark bees. No, I want to kill those. Yeah, those lich just have to die. Anyway, as long as he doesn't have like some good speed bows, then he's just another kiting victim. Another one to the list. No cast by him. Kinda like this guy being war and there basically being a little bit of a war of attrition due to wraiths. You know? There's a li there's something there. At least a little bit of something. I don't deal much damage to this guy, he's really, really tanky. But also he's susceptible to kiting. Wait, but I needed an ammo card for this. Don't die? 334, so 110 shots is dealing. Yeah, I actually will not be able to kill this. Interesting. Yeah, this guy is just... Should you have a munition card? I mean, I did at some point have one. I don't anymore. 297. Mmm... The stone skin was not really doing too much. I could try and get rid of it if I really wanted to, but I don't really want to. I could also take retaliations and hit him a little bit. Yeah, if I had ammo card, this is just the easiest fight ever, but Oh, but out the ammo card, it becomes problematic. How many magic cards do I have? Not that many. What else do I have? Um, if I made more one stacks. Elementals to take retail, this is curse ground, no hyper level casting for me. Yeah, no. Uh we can't do it like this. We need to find. Oh, town, hello. A black curse is upon you, bad luck. Leon, where is the necromancer? War. War will be the undoing of all. You cannot defeat death. Oh, I just lost 250k gold, Jesus. Okay, this is a town. First eight ten for the triple stone skin. Oh, uh, no tavern still. Upgrade estate. The white riders, leaders of the armies of the dead. Okay, he wants me to defeat war. I mean, if I fight inside the town, it's gonna be quite a bit easier. Even it's already like not too hard. I uh, I could get a. If only we had an ammo card. That is true. But also irrelevant. Because uh, we will not have one. But if we can like, just sit in, in a castle forever. You guys should attack me, right? Okay, let's do it a little bit differently. Now attack me. Here we go. That's better. boy. So I need to do two things. Uh, first of all, okay, this is still cursed ground, which is unfortunate. Oh, um, also I did it wrong. I should most definitely slow. Then wait and shoot here. It's quite a bit better. 
then I should be baiting these around. Yeah, now I only have to kill wraiths, you see? The rest can be handled by the towers, because the towers will be shooting infinitely. So while the wraiths are alive, we need to be a little bit careful about our positioning. When the wraiths are gone, it's going to be quite a bit easier. Okay, okay, that will move towards me. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, man. Um, yeah, just misclick. Kind of funny, a castle hero defending Necro versus an undead. Yeah? So do you be sometimes. Oh yeah. Uh, we want to kill this off, we want to be... Honestly, just... Well, no, just... Oh, uh, use the shots properly. I do want to have a wait for him. And then I want to use it to get rid of this, and then... Okay. Uh, it was almost horrible, but then it wasn't horrible, so that's nice. Then I can have another wave turn. Wait, let's see. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. No. Um, it cannot reach me within three turns, actually. I mean, it cannot, uh... I cannot have a wait turn unless he doesn't reach me in three turns. Is yeah, what I mean to say here. So I have to be 12 moves away or more. I guess I got rid of that. Uh huh. I think that's getting easier and easier. Now only these two stacks remain. Again, need to not forget the slow turn. And then I'll show you a machine gun, okay? I'll show you what is the closest thing that you can get to a machine gun in Heroes of Mind and Magic 3, okay? It's gonna be glorious. I will kill the stunt at some point, okay? Like now. So we just give stones for a turn team? Well, yeah, but we have the a very powerful tool that will help us here with that. Um, it's called the Shadow of Death, a single-player plugin, and we will use it as a as an absolute Gatling gun. Also, I just lost my entire Arcane stack. That's not very good. Bro, do I need you or no? It's fine. Bro, I don't need these arcs. I have so many in other places that I'll be getting. Maybe I need them. Nah, no way, man. Okay, anyway, I will show you the Gatling. Well, no, I'll show you when the time is right, and the time is not right right, right now. Wow, even the Q-Enter doesn't do anything. What the hell? Wait, is it fast? What's the fastest way? Yeah, you see? Like, this is the Tower Gatling gun. <laughs> Wait, is this? No, this has to be faster. Yeah. Or we can do this, which is even faster. But now we need to... Oh well, yeah, we need to finish and uh, decline. Unfortunately, because I just suck apparently. Anyway, I will be playing at this speed. Uh, we do this, and uh, yeah, we just kite. And we can like pretty into the blue guy, to be honest. We also have enough shots, so it's fine. Um, yeah, I kill off a few stacks here. It's just gonna be, like, way more convenient. And convenience is nice. I like convenience.
Yeah, we all are pretty good here by now. Uh huh? Oh! I blame Shadow of Death. This would never happen in Hoda. I'm not even joking. This would never happen in Hoda. Sometimes, like, TX creatures are a little bit silly to control, okay? And that's why I'm silly. So, um, that's quite the combo. Anyway, um, yeah. Uh, we are back here, and yeah, this time we're gonna be fine for sure. You can just cycle these two spots infinitely, right? Without, like, worrying about much. Um, correct. We are getting our mana drain, though it doesn't really matter. Mm hmm. Like, should I mean thing, old Papa san? <laughs> uh, funny that Max Sandra says that as I'm beating down the Necromancer. Uh, but yeah. Sometimes. Anyway, this time we are doing pretty fine. Oh yeah, we will not be able to use the uh, Q enter thing to have a very fast finish, because then Archangels will go ahead and die. So right now we need to go here, and we need to kick it up into high gear, and then we need to hold down the button. Uh, yeah. Look at him waving. He's like, guys! Gonna get in? Nah, bro. Suffer the Lich Gatling gun. So, how's the weather? The day was nice to begin with, but then it got cloudy and rainy. But I also like that, so the weather's pretty good. Um, yeah. Brrr. Yeah. Do we have any shots remaining? One. Boom. There we go. <laughs> the sound effects, too. It's like, uh, the sound effects is like, uh, that of, like, some space game from the uh, 1990s, you know? Like, one of those early games. Space Invaders. Duel the day later. Um, no. Today I'm gonna be playing this map. Uh, whenever I do PvP challenge maps, I don't really, like, swap around back into PvP. 3D Pinball. Space Pinball. Yeah. These are the sound effects that we're experiencing here. Uh, we already 500 rounds in, by the way. Yeah, the zombie's getting pummeled. Oh, uh, very good. That was gonna run, on, run out of shots. Uh, I believe if they were gonna be running out of shots, they already would have. They already shot like over 600 times. How many shots do you think they have? So yeah, here we go. Mm. And war is done. We get Cape Conjuring, Lux Legion, and a level up. Only one, actually. Um, that is something. 1024 would be my guess. Good day, by the way. Mm hmm 783 rounds. Sheesh. Yeah. Now, the question is, do I want to, like, flag these dwellings? Do I ever care about them? The vampires could be interesting. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> so, we have defeated war, and we can just continue. So, I kind of want to pick up the obelisk here, too. The curses are still... Um... Yeah. The curses are still wiping away my stuff, too. Well, yeah, let's just move on. Okay, well, that's everything. Yeah, that's everything. Wait, is it? No, it's not. Okay, cool. I still have some... Yeah, I held on to some amount of gold here. That means that all the income and all the other stuff that I got and that I'm getting um, is actually pretty efficient, pretty good. So, that's nice. <laughs> Thank you.
flag them now or regret later? Well, I mean, even if I flag them, it's not like I'm gonna be like picking them up. So yeah. Oh wait, it just goes around. No, it's finally not goes around. Thank God. I can actually use my spells. Imagine that. Interesting. Oh, very good. Oh, we can get more stats on Leon, naturally. More cards of prophecy, more... How many um? I guess we're just dealing with the undead menace over here right now. Not even that much of a menace though. Just some walkie boys that can't get to my sharpie so they get arrowed. Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, we can... Now, why did I do that gate, though? That's the question that I have. I guess we're when I get like summoned bot and stuff and then I can... Wait, I had like boost adaptation. I could have like used them. I mean, I could have at least tried to use them. Uh, yeah, that's kind of a thing. Anyway, oh, uh, what we can do here is we can... Mm. Also, this guy is annoying. Is that many? Fuck yeah. Anyway, let's uh, reposition here a little bit. Now it's gonna be a rather simple fight. Pretty weird split here. There we go. Oh, the vampires are defeated, and there's not really any gold here. Oh, we get some big side. Interesting. Um, hmm. Anyway, it's a new day, so we can collect, like, all the army with all the heroes here still. Dude, when I go for, like, some reinforcements, I'm gonna be having a lot of reinforcements. Because, yeah, I'm keeping pretty diligent on some collection here. Uh, for now still. Don't you have a hero viewer for map challenge? I do, but I tend to not use it much for these. That's, like, the original Shadow Death experience. It's, like, pretty cool anyway. And, um, yeah. It's basically all the rest, yeah. I cannot walk over here, so okay. I need to head over for this side. You have another Legion of Wraiths, um, as is usual, I suppose. Another round of army complete over here. Uh, meanwhile, Angelina sells like uh, plenty to accomplish. Uh, yeah. He's on shot. Yeah, nice and simple. There's even more dwellings over here. 
I mean, maybe if I flag dwellings, there's gonna be like less army. Um, pretty yeah, I don't line. Maybe like that's enough of a point to just do these, I guess. And I immediately want to start hiding them. At least somewhere. Oh, uh, looking shot is pretty cool. When will the heart here and deads begin? We've already saw hints of it, but uh, yeah, not much. This fight is easier than the last. I'm gonna be recovering my mana here. Uh, very soon after, so I don't really care for that at all. And yeah, we can just recover and move on. I could use the Altair Sacrifice to um, open up some army slots. And we are immediately faced with another tedious looking fight. Eh, I suppose. Wait, he hit me. Doesn't truly matter. So now what do we do? We were set to destroy art items only that we have copies of. Uh yeah, so let's do that. The hourglass of the evil hour does not really seem like a very useful art team. Especially when they're like so common they're literally in the entire ground. I'm not going to be sacrificing anything else though, but I think that these sacrifices are pretty obvious. I am going to be leaving some behind though. Um, this is just to clear up some uh, item slots by the way. Um, not a reason. Mm-hmm. Famine. Yet another one of these white riders, this time controlling countless vampires. Where is the necromancer? Ha ha ha! Famine will bring suffering to all. He cannot defeat death. Is this another one that I need an ammo card for? Well, he's just enemy deading. And I'm not really dealing a lot of damage. Not a particularly hard fight, but... Dude, where's my ammo card, man? Or where's my clone or something? I was told I was gonna be getting some good spells here, but... So far we have, like, nothing. Anything else that I can or should do? Maybe summon some Ellie's, I guess. I'll need to figure out a way to... Go through the rest of his hit points, so... I think we may as well stack up on these for now. Um, because mine is also like quite a bit better than mine. This is, which is most definitely a shame. I'll say that's enough for now. Slow here. Okay. Uh, 
Well, it's a single target slow though, so it's not very intimidating or anything. Three point five K remains. And that's the last of his cast. I still have five shots, which will be a hundred vampire I mean five hundred vampires, and then the rest I will have to brawl down. Um yeah. But he's still animate if you even if you're dealing oh, even if you deal a lower damage. That's an interesting question. Um, something to maybe explore if my initial attempts don't succeed here. Oh uh, yeah. We need to make some new stacks. Hmm. Magic arrow. Not efficient enough, I think. This guy's out of mana, but yeah, oh, we cannot beat this fight right now. I just don't have enough firepower. But maybe we don't have to go here yet. Maybe we can find an ammo card somewhere. How is it? How is the entire game so dependent on the one ammo card that I don't have? Bruh. I can maybe walk over there too. I don't know, maybe we want to return and scout around. Or do we... Okay, well, let's try this option. I need four Sharpies to kill a Vampire Lord. So we load campaign... No, we load single scenario. A battle. There's a war machine factory under the necro Wait, there is? Wait a moment. Disrupting right. And yeah, he does not animate one. He does not spam disrupting right either. Hmm. Okay, where's this war machine factory? Under the Necro? Oh. Down. What? I... What? I can't see it. Oh, here! Wait, there was one here! All along! Oh, no. Why? Why dumb? Okay, fine, I'll go for it. I don't really see there being a better round. Man, I'm gonna walk into more curses. <clears throat> anyway, but I think I probably should flag all of this, to be honest. And these, uh, these events are finite, it's just that I'm grabbing every single individual one. Uh, which is annoying, but, uh, yeah. The challenge is reading XDX, and apparently seeing too. Well, yeah? Why wouldn't it be? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, man. I'm finally getting an ammo card. Now that is wonderful. Don't need the other war machines, just this one. And now we have to uh, go back for everything here, and uh, yeah, we're gonna be just fine. Though we did waste some time here doing this, but I don't mind too much. Oh uh, yeah, I don't mind that at all. And yeah, I can get the stalling to shine. There's still curses out here. Jeez. Um, yeah. Anyway, uh, we have zero resources. And we're okay with this. 
It's a new week, so we can get some more army on um on the queen. We need enhances grab draken. Well, it's not any, as easy as just grabbing, but I believe we are we are, work, we are working towards them. This is Leon's soul, and we need to uh, pass the final test in order to get to him. And then, yes, we can make many, many Enhancer. Well, depends on the gold that we have, of course, but we can make many, many Enhancer. Trust. Uh-huh. So, yeah, we just slow and... Pew, pew! Pew, 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 pew! pew. I just have to be aware of the slow... Oh, uh, when the slow time's up, and if I'm aware of that, then nothing can possibly stop me here. Easy, Kyrino. Anyway. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's gonna be running out of mana soon. That's where we will actually start. Oof, 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 Okay, I guess I have to be aware of the angel morale as well. That's another thing. Bro, why the angels gotta do that? Yeah, it's angel fault, not mine. I will... I will... For the sake of nothing, for the sake of no other reason than impair myself, I'm gonna equip the spirit of oppression. I know the opponent can't morale, I know I'm the only one that can morale, I do not want a morale. Because if I like, try to mind every morale, I'm gonna be like so much slower, and I don't want to be that slow, so... A reasonable option. Yeah, now we're cooking. Now we're doing them. This is the one. The run. The fable. Out of mana, that's good. Now these guys are actually starting to die. Bye. Oh, uh, very nice. So, another one of these heroes is Duffyden. Would I ever cast Offensive Cast on Ammo Cart? Uh, yeah. I believe so. Plague. Oh, no. Black Price, right from the Evil Fog. Another city. The Plague will bring another horrible, agonizing death to all. You cannot defeat death. I've had enough of this bullshit. <laughs> okay, um... That's a pretty straight to the point protagonist that we have here. Uh-huh. Uh, we can finish up the army rally. We need a better army. Yeah, but I can't really go back for army either. We have to, like, complete everything with the current one. We have, like, so much army that we could rally into. Like, it's amazing, but, uh... Yeah, not quite. Let's see, how does this feel? Probably horrible, but uh, we'll see. Well then. 
How do we ever handle this? The guy even has stack decks. I don't think I can beat this guy. Uh, maybe like, maybe I had, do you have an idea? If I had ballistics, would that do anything? Not really. Well, actually, yeah, then I could be not destroying the walls as I go. That'd be nice. Yeah, that would actually be pretty nice. Dark Storm. And of course, this is gonna be the feed the thing. I hope there are no more of these white riders. Defeat plague. I just want defeat plague. I mean tactics. I need tactics. Mm. Without tactics, it's a little bit too hard. Uh, what it sounds? Uh, sounds means quite a few. Uh huh. Maybe we have to go back here, do stuff, we get stronger. Mm. Oh wait, maybe we can build into fear or something silly. And then we can actually rally army and then like everything that I was doing here, like the hard mode, I can just do easy mode. Honestly, please don't tell me I can build mage there, just don't tell me. I mean, I can, that I have to be here. Okay, research and construct, that's kind of whatever. We can also build mage level 5. Okay, let's like see how this is. So we need to get on top of them. Of course we can't blind, we can't do too much here. What if we fall what if we summon some water boys? Death Ripple is the cast of choice. Archangels is the Death target. That's the next death target. Uh huh. This guy only has the liches, though. Yeah, this guy basically only has liches. I can maybe handle that. But how? Does forget when it's not work? Um, no, because um, undead units are by default immune to uh, to that. Oh wait, actually, I have this ring of the magi, by the way. Is that any useful? Mm. Wait, what slot am I missing? This. Hey, is that a uh, subtle cheating? No, like, it doesn't feel like I can do this right now, so I'll just go back. Yeah, for now, I'll go back and try to go through the other side there. And maybe that's. Yeah, maybe that'll do something. I mean, may as well try, right? This is Nightmare. Oh, this is a Nightmare. Well, we'll see. Maybe I'll find a way to handle it. Oh, uh, this is... Is this a Shadow of Death campaign? Oh, uh, no. This is a Shadow of Death challenge map. So it's like a pretty specifically crafted, uh, constructed map where... Uh, yeah, there's a bunch of challenges that we have to um, get over. Um, we have to find our way, uh, there's like a story that uh, is here to you and everything. Devs are smoking crack. Well, the devs in this uh, situation is just like a uh, specific uh, map creator. Wait, so can we go anywhere with these boots, I wonder? I guess we'll see. Uh, for now I want to equip this and we are fine. Anyway, I gotta get through it. We've done way harder before, by the way. Okay, I can actually go here and uh, gain quite a bit of strength. That's cool. I like that. I like that quite a bit, actually. Hmm. Bless is okay.
Annoying. Very. Wait, that's not what I meant to cast. Anyway, let's just get away from here for a moment. Oh, pick these back up, pick these back up. Pick these back up and pick these back up and yeah, this is fine. Uh, we have collected all the army with Queen Sarna, I believe. Yeah, so we can chill. And not pick the unicorns, yes, but that's because I don't care about them, of, of course. Then we can have like another rally over here. I have no idea if I will ever be able to actually use this, but names will seem pretty positive. I will go for power. This is nothing. Now we have a horde of fairies. Drying's got these lands. Many have tried to steal the treasures, but none have been successful. Hmm. What is the route here? Very interesting indeed. Then we need speed prio, then we need to blind one of the stacks. And now we can just pick up the Archangels. Uh, we can like quick cast this and uh, do it really fast. Wait, why can I not control Z? Then we need to wait for this to expire actually, but it's quite a few rounds. Okay, we just passed 50 rounds, we need 17 more. Mm -hmm. Phew. Oh, we are out of mana. That's not good. Hmm. Rip card? Yeah, I mean, we can pick up another one over here if we need, really need to. We could go to the mana call again if we really need to. And, you know, we might. The Utopias will be pretty, yeah, pretty lucrative thing to go through as well. Uh, which I like. Sharpshirt is all we have, and without armor cards, uh, they are worthless. Very correct. I have to be like, against a very ridiculous amount of army for ammo card to be necessary. I mean, we're doing... We're kind of chilling here right now. Oh, we're making a lot of progress every which way. And that feels nice. What would not? What would not feel nice, though, is to get morale on by these sprites. I'd have to go back to the Mandicle as well. It's kind of annoying. This goes two ways. Alright. What is this one? Wood? <laughs> Lol. Uh, yeah, maybe not. Wait, how much can I trade up? I can have a thousand wood. At the most, this thing needs 10,000. Yeah, I guess that's not happening. Hmm. We wish to help you. Okay, I get... I get golems. Interesting. I cannot really do these fights, right? Not without mana. I just need mana. I... Yeah. I will not do this fine. Right now, I will scout out for a magic well. And hopefully I'll get one. Decently easily. If not, well... Kind of red, but... Okay. Oh, still making rounds for army. Hmm. Any magic well? No, no magic well over here. So, we will... Yeah. We'll have to go back all the way to this magic wall over here. Annoying, but not really preventable. Then we can do the Utopias. We might be able to get like interesting artifacts over here that will help us in dealing with all of those. For example, like Black Orb would go like a very, very long way in terms of helping me here uh, to deal with them. Also, the stats that I've gained already are 
Rare Helpful Teal. I have like a little bit of army here that I'm not going to be using right now. As they are in low enough quantity that they're just basically slow me down. I have so much armor to buy here and stuff. Dude, I could like almost 10x my count of uh, Sharpies. Oh, by the way, I should probably put away the Dumb Golem Steel. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's a good idea. And uh, Angelina is going to be chilling here. So all the other heroes are done. We can just move around with Leon for like a little while. Yeah, Dumb Golems are here. And we move on. 100 danger deal. I mean, yeah, if I could like rally builds right now, then. That would be super. Wait. I want to. I missed the uh, dialogue there. Oops. A big demon army has been spotted near the shores of Old Valencia. Old Valencia, Old Valencia, Old Valencia. What is Old Valencia? Big demon army. Oh no. Am I behind schedule, I wonder? Okay, I've defeated death already. Oh no. Anyway, we're going to be force feeling this. That will be, yeah, pretty easy. Now that we have mana, yeah, now that we have mana, this is not a worry at all. I believe in pick up the two little ones. And yeah, let's see what's in the top That's annoying. I believe that if we wait, you enter. Yeah, this is good. Crown, boots, purse. I mean, crown is pretty useful, but also pretty much not something that we need. And not something that helps us that much either. Okay, we, uh... Defeat death, Lex you the immortal. Wait, I kinda... If you read up your wars, will be the same. Um, yes. No, this is just not right. Fine, I'll make the two one stacks. I just was a little bit... optimistic. Oh, but two stacks are the Sharpies uh, start at the Northern Hex instead, and making for a very easy and nice uh, first fill setup over here. Whoops. Bro. The autos are not the same in Shadow of Death. Dragon Skill Shield, Endless Sacker Gold, and Ebro and Wait, do we have a goose? Do we have a goose? No, we don't. Uh, we have Endless Purse, Endless Bag, and Endless Sack. Wait, we should have a goose. Oh, wait, isn't Goose a Hoda Arty? I do have all the parts of a goose. It's just that it's not... A thing in Shadow of Death, I guess. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's no goose here. Ah, uh, that's kind of sad. Anyway, we did gain like a bunch of styles. We got quite a bit stronger here recently. Hmm. If I turned all the resources that I had before losing them to curses into wood, would I have had enough in order to access this? Hmm. Anyway, um, so I explored all of this. Is there anything else that I can do here? Wait, maybe I can just leave. I mean, if I was able to leave, I could actually rally up quite a bit more army and like go for this belt and stuff. And that would be a very, very big deal. And then I can like come back with like a million more army. Or and do I deem myself strong enough for 
Uh, that guy that I couldn't beat just before. Hmm. It's an interesting question, I suppose. 50 years since I saw a non-campaign or challenge map stream today. Oh, uh, yeah. 50 years. I guess you, like, missed some of them, too. Hey, yo. Can we go here? Anywhere? Not really. We could go... Here. Does that do anything? What is this? I mean, that's got to be elemental, same. Hmm. I mean, even if I could leave, would I want to leave right now? That's the question that I have. I uh, would be able to go past the one way here again and come back there for now. But, like, I need to defeat death anyway. But, like, am I strong enough? Like, if Plague is this strong, then how strong will death be, you know? Okay, let's try and stay here for one turn in order to see. Oh, this is West Valencia, I guess. And this is where the demons were. Doombringer. Wow. This place I could almost go to, but not yet. Um, okay. So, first of all, um, test my ability to leave this place. And the answer is no, I cannot leave this place. So all I have to do it with my current army, with my current setup, and that is not easy. Howdy, partner. Mm. Howdy, partner. Howdy, partner. Mm, Plague here is pretty strong. I wonder what's our level 5. Nothing. Literally nothing. Thank you for that. Um... Wait, then maybe I can go in a different direction, like here. No. Hmm. Why am I not fighting by standing here? I guess because you're on water and I'm not on water. That's all it ends up being. Did the archangels fly too close to the sun? Um, no. Not at all. Uh, we can go here. Uh, we can make the rest of the rally on Queen Sarna as well. Queen Sarna cannot uh, bring reinforcements to us either. Um, okay. So, this is the situation, eh? So, the way that I think that I should beat Plague is that I think that I should be sending in, like, Archangels and keep resurrecting them. But like, maybe a one stack will deal. Oh, actually, I think that's exactly what I should do. Okay, I think, especially now, with the new stats that I found, and the Utopias and such, I will be able to actually handle this and beat him. Also, should be recovering mana with the most amount of mana that I can deal. Card? I believe I have a card. No, I don't. Yeah, I guess I should probably pick up a card. Hopefully, the new Valencia Demons will not be too nasty here to me. Um, are they strong? Yeah. Zalcalypto. That's a cool name. Mr. Demon. Okay, so I have an idea and I will be executing here. And purple is maximizing his forces while we play in the mountains. Uh, this is a challenge map, so the in challenge maps usually like the path that you can take is usually very gated, so. It's not like we can't address that right now at all, as the passages are locked away behind like things that you have to deal. Wait, he could actually just maybe swim over to us. That would be horrible. So if he spams at some point, we'll have to decide to resurrect Archangel or get some Sharpies back. Well, towards the end, maybe we can just have a wait turn with like a few resurrections so immediately back to back. <clears throat> I can also go some for some ghosts here too. Mm, could be useful. Uh, Power Lich? Not really. Yeah, I don't care for that. Okay, um, let's try and do this then. 
Uh, we'll recover our mana over here. Panic game because we're a month far and we already and we have barely half the map discovered. Uh, then Duryat, you are very aware of how challenge maps are and they behave, and uh, you are treating it as a it as a normal randomly generated map. This is not a randomly generated map, so the standards of such don't really apply here. There could be maps that are completable within like one week. Like the Dark Man, and it's like the hardest map in the entire game. And there could be maps that are used to be played for years, um, like Zaidu, I believe, and that is also like one of the hardest maps, but like in a different way. Like um, the difficulties here are judged like very individually based on like the type of map that it is. Mm, yeah. Okay. So. Let's have a second go at Plague here. Um, hopefully, we are going to be strong enough, and hopefully, we are going to be smart enough to figure out a strategy for this guy, too. I have, like, slight ideas, but these ideas are only, like, um, yeah, like, tendencies of what I should do. Not any concrete plans. So, let's go. I believe this to be the setup. Um, doesn't really work. At least not initially. Of course, he's undead, so I can't really do too much against him either. Like, this tactics phase is actually what's screwing me over. Mm. Yeah, if it wasn't for the tactics phase, I'd be kind of fine. Mm. Maybe we should just try to outbrawl him. Do I have air shield? No, I don't. Wait, doesn't... Wait, let's see. What will he do now? Okay, now he goes for that. Um... Yeah, this won't do. At least not like this. Okay, uh, first of all, let's swap around the equipment for something better, of course. Uh, let's maximize our output. And try again. Mm, nothing else that's useful over here. I believe. Mm, 12 for 10, maybe. But like, I think that the day will immediately shoot the sharpies in this case. Mm, mm. And I can't even tell what a good cast is either. Yeah, you see? It could pick some of these back up, but like it doesn't even do anything. Um, hey Ryas. If I can get a top of them, but like I can't. I can't. But, okay, I can see some potential. No, 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 no. This is not the way to go. Um... I do have plus for morale. Not really any... You know, yeah. My equipment is already... As good as it's gonna get here. Hmm. So now the Archangels will get shot, and maybe that's fine. How about we just try to burst down the Apologists? Just, I'll brawl them. They're dealing 11k damage, that's pretty insane. Um, No way you will win. You say that, but it kind of feels winnable. I just need to figure something out. 
I just need to get on top of him like a little bit sooner. 250 stock should kill ghosties, I think. Not that, I mean, me splitting them doesn't really change my damage at all. Is this? Uh, let's say we bless up and shoot this. The arrow doesn't kill yet. And yeah, they just like cover up the spot steel. I need to like uh um hmm. Let me think. Maybe a different setup with call actually for different placements of his unit steel. Um so I could like try to experiment with that a tiny little bit. Uh here here. Here? Not the best, but like yeah. I just want to um, experiment with the AI behaviors. Um, that is the goal here right now. And like, what is your focus right now? I guess it will be one of the angel stacks. It's not too bad. And now we want to wait. Oh, this works, I think. Oh no, it doesn't. A oh, one stack survives. Well, now the idea is just to sit here, and yeah, we are covered up by... No, I mean, now we're just gonna get slapped by the liches. No, but that's okay. But I do need to reduce the, the this stack and this stack by a tiny little bit, but not too much either. Oh, and we need to kill that. No, it sits on the corpse. It's almost good enough, though. It's almost good enough. Because then we can like just cycle, resurrect, and we're fine. Yeah, okay, but this is getting like quite a bit close. I like it. Is this Bless really the best cast that I have here? Hmm. Perhaps. Then actually this time I will shoot the kill here. Realizing that they will stand in their place, but that's not too bad. The Archangel will I mean yeah, the Liches will shoot one more time. And I am okay with this, I think. I mean, I think I have to be okay with this. That's fine. And now I have to just resurrect and get in their place. But I also have to kill the Vampire Lost Steel. And also there should be a one stack blocking the gate. All of that needs to happen and I win. Yeah, just have all of it happen, lol. Um... This stack uses Resurrection, this one didn't, so we could benefit quite a bit from this, Re yeah. Sure. Can't really kill the Wraiths yet, but there's also like not exactly a big reason to kill the Wraiths yet either. The Vampires are a good kill. And this is a decent Resurrection. Mm, if we go here, then we will get blasted. Like, yeah, by the Liches, like, pretty horribly. Mm, let's see. Okay, if that is possibly still okay. Wait, but I actually I made a mistake by killing the vampire lords. Just kill everything but the lich first. Hmm. Anyway, I need to kill the race right now for sure. And I need to get this stack in place. And I think I do want to resurrect some of these uh, Sharpies here by now, too. And do block the gate. It felt bad the time that I didn't, so... Seems reasonable to me. This Death Ripple is dealing a lot of damage to you. 
Oh, my mana is better though. Whenever this guy will hit. Oh no. Okay. Well, that's not good. Hmm. I mean, we can play Whack a Mole where he can only kill like one of the two stacks at a time. And we can always just resurrect the other. Like, yeah, this happens and then we press. Then. Yeah, this whack a mole play style might just be good enough. Oh, and he killed the Ballista. That's actually like, pretty good for me. That means we actually should be focusing the Liches. Yeah, this kind of works. Though the Archangels will fall. Actually, that's completely fine. Mm, is it completely fine? He's always pulling that stack. And I am dealing okay damage. Though we did lose our ammo card already, so that's also kind of a concern. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. No, but actually this thing will die eventually. But maybe he will die first? I don't really know. And his only cast is slow, that's also like not very impressive. The gate is blocked, he can never go out. His uh, Lich stack is decreasing. Yeah, Resident 2 by the way. Oh yeah, I, can, I guess I could use that. If I started killing the Liches sooner here, though, I would have been better off, for sure. So, I think if I, yeah, try again, I will be able to find a win here. Because right now, even the mana is, like, not in my favor. Yeah, I will not have enough mana to pick up all of the army, but, like, I can kill... I would already win this fight, you know? Oh, he's out of shots. Oh, well, that's convenient. But he's not out of mana, and I, I'm out of mana, though. Yeah, okay. Um. Anyway, this will work. All we need to do is we need to block the gate, and yeah, shoot him very hard. Mm hmm. This happens, that's okay. I actually should have blessed up already. Though, the Ghosters and... Yeah, the Flyers should be killed, though. Yeah, the Flyers should be killed. That's also a thing. Okay. Um, let's try that again. Char should not stand next to the ammo card. Let's kill it otherwise. Yeah, but, like, we're not... Like, ammo is not a bottleneck for this fight, you see? And that's the thing. Um, boom. And we definitely want the Ballista to be killed before any of the walls fall. That is fine. That is pretty cool too. I do not want to waste any mana that I can save. Can we just handle this like uh, easily? Let's forget from this work on li liches. Um, no. I'll actually resurrect this right now. I'm already gonna just start pummeling those. Yeah, this is a nicer situation than we had last time. Because we got to this stage of the fight quite a bit sooner and cleaner. Mm, and yeah, that's amazing. Oh, oops, I just mm, didn't collect the rest. Eh, never. Mm, shiny.
Cool. And now we start on this lich thing. Oh wait, but the gates were open. No, 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 can't have that. Nope, 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 nope. This will not be the run. Hmm, is there anything else for me to cast here? I don't know, what if I summon some Ellie's? Oh. I would be lying if I said I particularly care about that. That is good. Okay, the ballista is down. Well, oh, there is a wall open. Bro, this is catapult is trolling me. And actually, we should put this one here and this one here. Uh, the sort of swap is gonna make it so... Yeah, this, kind of, this swap will make it nicer, because we can lose the bullets immediately now. Instead of like a little bit down the line, which is better. I actually kind of want to res this. Uh, res this. Res more. And yeah, now we start working. And now we start working on the Paul Liches. This time it's quite a bit weirder. Okay, now it's like the same, actually. We probably should not be having the, both the corpses on the same place. Uh huh. Nice. Having a single match right here would actually go a pretty long way. Um, okay. Some morals coming in, that's very nice. Okay, now I can focus that one, interesting. Moral and luck, very nice. And like, once again, uh, we are very limited by our mana. And blatantly put, we don't have enough. Uh, he's out of shots, that's very cool. That means we can actually just pick up our army and uh, blast away. <clears throat> By this point we can actually win the fight, but we'd be winning the fight without a lot of our army. And that's probably not acceptable. And yeah, we're getting blasted by this. Destroying that too. We can't really get rid of the towers that are pelting us either. Do resurrection with fresh shots? Um, no. I mean, even if we win... The cause does matter. But yeah, uh, barely not there. Maybe we can have a, some sort of a better setup too. Uh, let's see. First of all, am I at max max mana compared to like everything that I can equip? The answer is yes, unfortunately. Oh, I can actually go... Wait, I can use Pen of Life and be immune to death ripple. But in this case, I'm losing out on some might and some power, so my resurrections are weaker and stuff, but it's still like a very big deal. Yeah, it's a very big deal. Just go and take all your army. I can't. Like, there's no way for me to return here right now. You have to press onwards, so I can't go back. Hmm. Hey, Willem. 
Good day to you, team. But true ranking with pretty months. Thank, thank you. Oh, uh, he will just bolt you then, maybe. Wait, did he ever show bolt? I never saw bolt, so that would be a surprise. This here, this here. Bless up. Uh, pew, 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 pew. Mm -hmm. This does look nicer. Okay, now he weaknessed me. But, like, that doesn't really do anything. Um, I enjoy that. Well, naturally, I really want to get rid of the... Of that, yeah. Nice. Could keep the ammo card, but it doesn't really change anything. Yeah, no death ripples for him is very nice for me. It will let me be way more mana efficient. I think? Is that right? Hmm. <laughs> Can I outweigh all of his shots? Not really. I... Okay, well... Okay. Let me try and think here. Uh, what if we just try to force it anyway? Alright. Mm, should I then? Is there maybe like a better army setup that I can have here? You can use 3 to 4 stacks of Sniper for optimal resort value. That's actually kind of a cool idea. Wait, that's an amazing idea. Is this me being split enough? Or no? Well, I guess I can just like split them manually. This here. This remains. You... You move. move. Yeah, this will make it way better actually, now that you mention it. Do I keep my resurrection? Yeah, maybe. You can just cure. Pull him out. Um anyway. Kill off the mana suckies. And continue on to other stocks. Wait, oops, I should have resurrected immediately. Now I'm actually just a turn behind because of that. Mm -hmm. Okay, I basically get that turn back here like this. Mm, is that fine? Yeah, it's fine. Hmm. Let's actually go for this resurrection instead.
Now, almost all of our Sharpies are actually attacking every turn. Means that we'll kill them even before their shots are up, actually. Very nice. So this might just be enough value that we're squeezing out. Well, by now it's a little bit annoying, but... Ooh, that's dangerous. No, it opened the gate. Man. No, I... Ah, I messed it up. I'll... Yeah, I should have... Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Anyway, I can do it better. Uh, I can do it quite a bit better, so... We'll just... Well, do it quite a bit better. This one has to move. And this one has to move. We have Blast Off. I do want to use this Resurrection, and then I want to pull down these stacks for now. Are we waiting? We are waiting. That's good. I do not want to use this Resurrection inefficiently. Um, is there anything else for us to cast that's like any important at all? Yeah, I want to be not behind in terms of my Resurrection, so... Like you should disappear. What if you kill everything else before Lich? Uh, if you just enter Lich ammo uh, almost every time anyway, then you don't have to worry about the uh, things. Other things selling for. Uh, the towers would be very annoying in terms of getting my optimal resurrections out. And I can kill the polishes in time with all the other army being stuck inside anyway, so. Yeah. It just seems like it's gonna be a. Uh, like, what you're suggesting is like pretty efficient in some ways, but not in the way that I'm looking to be efficient. Yeah, we always just respawn to a lit shot with a resurrection, and we are cooking. We're cooking pretty well here. Almost all of our stocks are still alive and shooting. That's awesome. Oh. Actually, let's just wait for now. Oh, wait, no, it's fine. Um. Good. Mm. Hey, Wazzy. He, I'm, <clears throat> I still have 300 mana, and he's already like down to half legends, so I think, yeah, this is going really, really well. Mm -hmm. I don't want to use up, actually, I will use up this resurrection. So this is kind of well. Actually, no. I could be like not weakened on some of these stacks as well. No, no, no. I would lose out on tempo, but I would remove the weakness. He's down to ten shots. So you need to make sure that the gates are in fact blocked every time. Not getting death ripple is amazing. So yeah, it seems like we'll find a win here in this fight. And we're finally not getting killed by lit shots. Mm -hmm. That was the last tag that could fly, and now we just need to pick up all of our army back up and end the fight. 
Well, we can do angels first. Mm -hmm. We still have good enough shots on my on my hero here as well. Yeah, okay, we're doing it. Yeah, where's all the doubtless now? Naturally, we will not end the fight before we have all of our army back up. Okay, I think we have all of our armies, so pew pew. Okay, we did it! Oh, uh, yeah. We did it. We beat down all the liches, everything, and lost no army. We also got an ogre club of havoc. Uh huh. Save. Okay, that's a good idea. Um. Uh, li liches down. Oh, uh, very good. Skull transformer, amplifier, yeah. Another great undead down here, and I guess I'm going to be chilling here for mana. For a turn. These other things are complete here too. Um, yeah, the army is rallied. Good. Or I'm a card. Wait, 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 this guy's not going to be docking next to me, right? I don't think it's even possible. Yeah, I don't think he's going to be able to attack me here. Uh, good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's go forward. Yeah, there's pretty much nothing over here. What neck for more mana? Oh, yeah, shut up. So it doesn't exactly matter. Well, actually, it might matter quite a bit. For all I know. Mm hmm. I wonder if we could maybe find Power of the Dragon Potter. That'd be kind of cool. It seems like the only way is to go underground. Uh, yeah. It is, isn't it? Uh, Blast, so we one shot. Hmm. Day 7, so we don't have to rally up anything quite yet. Oh, uh, this is pretty okay. Oh my god. Wait, will he be able to, like, enter my lands and just take everything? Again? Dude, am I losing everything again? I don't think that the queen can actually hold back Zocalypto here. Uh, even after all this rallying... Dude, that would suck so much. Please, no. Now we have dungeon creatures here. Weird. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I suppose that's fine. 